hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Ola Ma Treasure and if it's your first time watching welcome to my channel um, so today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to achieve these bonita locks using bobby moon locks so if it's your first time watching thank you very much for watching and please do not forget to subscribe if you're interested in this content so i'm going to be using these bobby new locks that i got off of amazon and i'm also going to use this spring twist hair to twist the hair so let's get right into the video guys i've already done two i'm now going to be showing you guys a sample of one that i'm going to do so first i will have to crochet the bobby new locks in and then try to insert her natural hair the braided natural hair into the bobby new locks now i'm not gonna lie this was a struggle for me because it was my first time using the bobby new locks but at some point towards the middle i got to know that the best way to put it is to take your crochet and get the the hair that you want to insert make sure that the crochet touches the tail of the braid and then you drag it into the bobby new locks i don't know if that makes sense but hopefully that makes sense to you guys okay so yeah I've inserted the first one and now I am inserting the rest just so it's easier for me um, when I'm trying to wrap with the spring twist here. So in order not to confuse you guys, first I'm going to insert the bobby new locks about as many as I can to make it easier for me and then I'm going to use the spring twist to wrap using the usual um, bonita locks method that I usually use. The next thing I'm going to do after um, installing the bobby new locks is to begin to wrap with my spring twist hair using my bonita locks method. So um, the reason I'm using this bobby new locks is because I'm trying to achieve an extended length. Um, it has a very stretchy. Oh my god, it's so windy. It has a very stretchy feel to it so the more you wrap the more the hair extends the more it stretches so I use an 18 inch right 18, I think 18 or 20 inch for the bobby new locks and by the time I was done wrapping the hair was up to the locks was up to 32 inches so yeah if you're looking to get like an extended length this is the best method for you to go okay yeah so that's just the method i'm using for this and if you haven't watched my bonita locks tutorial is basically using the spring twist hair and as i'm wrapping the spring twist hair i'm going to be holding it on with my thumb just to give it a distressed look um so for more details about the video i'm going to be linking it up somewhere so you can click it and watch it if you want more details um yeah so from here on out i'm going to leave you guys to watch the rest of the video please if you like this video give it a thumbs up and subscribe and share with your friends and family do not forget to subscribe guys please help me get to 1000 subscribers please guys um if this content is favorable to you and if this video is helpful please tag me on instagram if you try it at braid underscore section that's my business page on instagram please follow guys all right 
see you guys in my next video okay and thank you so much for watching i really appreciate you guys bye